still at home with the kids wondering what the heck you can do with them to keep yourself sane and keep them busy? Well, we were wondering that too. That's why we call Amy Latta back from Amy Latta Creations. She has some ideas to keep everyone busy and happy during this time that we're stuck at home, right? Absolutely. <laughs> So today we're going to be playing with stencils because that's something that kids of all ages can do. I okay. mean, as soon as a child can do this with a paintbrush, yeah. they can stencil. That is true. Now, the first question people are going to ask, like, I don't have this stuff at home. How am I supposed to go out and get it? Well, that's where Amazon comes in. Yeah. We can find handy dandy unfinished wooden trays, unfinished wooden signs, yes. any kind of wooden surface, you can stencil on it. Right, and you can get that super quick in two days, so you're going to need it, you might as yeah. well. And so what did you buy all, you got the paint there, you got the little sponge brushes, what else did you get? Yes, so you choose whatever your surface is, you need acrylic paint, Ours are the Martha Stewart family friendly kind that are especially good for kids. Not but toxic, yes. Exactly, mm -hmm. but any kind of acrylic paint that you have is good. Yes. And if you have a stencil brush, that's the best thing to use. But if not, a sponge brush works just Perfect. fine. Or just a sponge. Just I mean, sponge, honestly, yeah. especially if you have little ones, just mm -hmm. to take that sponge and cut it up, it works the same way. It sure does. So there you go. Okay. And then you choose the stencils that your yes. child wants to play with. So one of my sons, Nathan, he loves outer space. Okay. So <laughs> he made the space tray. He oh, painted cute. the whole thing with a dark blue, and yeah. he actually went over it with an even darker blue. If you can kind of see, there's different yeah, there's layers there. of blue yeah, yeah. in there. Yeah. And then we had these really cool adhesive stencils. Yes. And he just stuck them where he wanted them to go, chose his colors, stenciled, and then we got to put the stars on, which was the really fun part. Yes. Because you just load your paintbrush with paint, and then you get to flick it. That's, and <laughs> that's everybody's favorite part. It is part. fun. Except yeah. moms, because we have to clean it up. Well, they can go but, outside and do it. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. And it's non-toxic, so it's okay. There you go. <laughs> and we and so, did a I'm sorry, sign. you said how old is your son that did this one? He is 12. He is 12. This is really yeah. good. Okay, got it. And then this one, cute yeah. little alien there. Yeah, I actually did this sign did because <laughs> he was having so much fun that I yes. wanted to play too. Yes. So I made this, we say, love you to the moon and back in Very our family. Sweet. Yes. I know a lot of people like that saying. Yeah. So I did this for on his wall. Yeah. And I just used the same stencils that he was using and put some of my hand lettering on it to make it personal. Perfect. Now I asked you, I have a very girly girl. Um, I was not such a girly girl growing up, so it's all sort of new to me, but she is all into the butterflies and the pink and the purple and all that. And you had a butterfly stencil yes. that you said we could make something today. So it'll yes. be a tray sort of like this one. It, it will, yep. So you just choose whatever stencil your child loves. There's mm -hmm. pirate ships, there's superheroes, and mm -hmm. there's butterflies for the girly girls. And I imagine too that we could probably make these stencils too ourselves, right? If you're a little bit more If crafty, you really want to try that, you, you can try. You do that. I love how, how she says if you really out. want to try that. But I'm just thinking if you had sort of a piece of paper or a piece of plastic and you sort of cut out a shape. That's true. Or if you happen to have a Cricut machine, you <laughs> like, could do that. That, that work would work better. <laughs> <laughs> try it and let me know how that works. <laughs> <laughs> I will, and I'll put it on my Instagram, so there. All you right. do that, I'll be watching. <laughs> <laughs> I love the challenge, okay. So you, you peel do off the order back. a stencil, these are extra nice because they're adhesive. Yes. And I love these for kids because what that means is you put it down where you want it to be, uh -huh. and then it doesn't move. Okay, it actually got it. sticks there. Yes. Yes. And that's really helpful for kids and for grown-ups when that's you're stenciling. True. And then we can just take one of these. Yes. No, put it in the... Before you do that, let, oh, me, let me tell you. Already messing up. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> when you're stenciling, yes. less is more. So okay. you want a little bit and you want to dab it, it okay. off a little. All right. So see how I'm offloading? Is that good? That's good. And okay. then you're going to go in kind of an up and down motion. Okay. And you want to be careful not to use too much paint. A lot of people get yes. upset when they try to stencil because they think they don't get a clean image. And the reason why that happens is 99% of the time because you're using too much paint. Okay, is that too much and or does that look okay? Enough. Um, I see how you can still see the tray. Yes. You wanna make sure you see purple there instead right. of the teal. All right. Yep. But you wanna make sure that your brush is almost dry when you're doing this because okay. that way it's not gonna seep underneath. Got it. All right. And then when you're done, you can just peel the stencil up okay. and there's a butterfly. Oh, that's really pretty. Okay, let's see if my butterfly is okay. Because <laughs> right now, Amy doesn't Fingers have crossed. too much confidence in me. But oh, we're I see. do. <laughs> I'm sure. just nervous nice about the stencil I'm just making joking. idea. Can I've I never it? tried it personally. I can't lift it there. Oh, okay. Is yeah. it really stuck? So we need, it's, well, it's adhesive. Probably because we're, 
<laughs> there we go. It's cold. It's hey, hey it's now. Really you did it. It does look good, you guys. All right. So to get more ideas, we should just go to Amy Ladder Creations. Please do. Come All right. visit me at amyladdercreations.com. Perfect. Thank you so much for being here. Of course. And we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned.